Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. Uh, I've been playing this deck for a while, man. I, I, it's pretty hilarious how it all works. Um, mostly what you're trying to do. Uh, everything in this deck pretty much has revenge. Uh, your Inquisitor Mokdos, your Stone Powder Alchemists, your Piercing Grief. The whole idea of the deck is to pull as many of these guys as you can... And they keep coming back. If they got revenge, then what you want to do is have this Pathfinder put Echo on them so you draw two of them. So you keep drawing a bunch of revenge units and they keep coming back. That's why I named the deck Adele because it's just like, hello, hello. <laughs> they just keep coming back. You got a lot of control options with the... Um, these guys pop out as a silence answer. Um, they're ambushed, so you can just drop them straight out. Uh, but I only got one Banish in here to kill some lower strength stuff. Uh, three Slays. The big the big heavy hitter is Harsh Rule. There's four of them in the deck. So if they overcommit, you can just nuke their whole board, and then your revenge units start taking over. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much The Temple Scribes are just there to get through the cards. Uh, Ancient Lore to draw more cards. And then you want to use Excavate to keep playing either Ancient Lore or Harsh Rule. One or the other. It all depends. But uh, that's pretty much it. Let's, uh, let's play a couple games and see how it goes. Alright. This is a little bit better. We got some mana. Um, but we don't have really anything to play. So we're going to redraw it. All right. So we could play this. We got our banish. We could play next turn if he plays anything we want to get rid of. We got harsh rule, but no greens. All right. Lucky for us, he's not a rush deck. Cause if he was, we'd be dead already. <laughs> All the colors of the room. Oh, wow. Crown of Possibilities. Okay. Uh, we need to draw some mana. I could see a lot of little things coming down. Usually when they play this, they, they play a bunch of little things and they start getting like life steal and a bunch of other stuff. Hey, mana. At least next turn we can, we know we can't even play that. We can kill something if he plays something big. Hey, make each bullet count. All right. So we got a guy out there. Seven mana. What is he waiting to play? Alright. So we want to draw a green. Unfortunately, we can't. But, we'll play this guy. Hopefully, we get something good with Echo. Still can't play this or this. Oh my goodness. This is going to get so ugly so fast. We'll attack with these. Alright, he's letting them through. They're coming. If we don't draw a green, though, we're just going to be in a world of hurt. We could kill one thing. Okay, there's the harsh rule. We're okay with that, because these aren't our heavy hitters. Hey, a yellow. Alright. So now we could start drawing our cards. Echo for that's not bad. Echo for that's pretty good. And we'll play... We'll play one. Alright. 
He might tank it down. That's fine. It goes right back in the deck. So he's got to start playing some of his big stuff here. Hey, it came right back. And we get two of them to play, which is awesome. This is where it starts getting good. Alright. So, f well, if we're going in, we're going in. We don't really care. If they die, they die. I mean... <laughs> he's down to one health. If we get one damage, he's dead. All these go back in the deck. So we could play this next turn. I don't know how he comes back from this. That's a lot of guys. And I can even silence something here with an ambush. So we start our turn. There it is. That's game. Let's see if he's got the answer. He does not. GG. Let's play one more. Because I, I want to see... Oh, we got a chest. We got a couple of those. That's some free dust. Okay. Yeah, the key is to get that echo rolling. Just to keep getting echo on your revenge unit so that when they come back, you get two of them and they go right on the board. Um, I think we redraw this. We need better cards. All right, this is good. We got some mana this time. We're, we got some some good mana options here. So I think first we throw out this one. Because if we need to, we could cycle this one out. And we'll have enough for harsh rule. Put five fire bombs in your deck. That's going to suck a little bit. Time quick. Right. We start turn. Okay. We just end turn. We're not scared. We if he's playing uh time, he's probably got the Who says you can't play with the five, five sixes to keep flyers from going. That we're gonna silence. I think you can escape me. Um. Yeah, we'll play the green. Draw a card. End the turn. He'll probably kill this with something. Ooh, we kill that though. Uh, we'll block this. We're okay with that. Alright. So we kill this. Play this. And we pass the turn. So he's probably not playing the five sixes. Oh, there's that charge thing. That's fine. Will he draw a card? Brace yourself. He deals double damage to players. We'll block that. We're okay with it. If he overcommits, we got harsh rule. Uh, I think we play this. Get some echo on there. Pass the turn. He's going to play that four. 
we're gonna let it go by. I think we can afford to. There's that. Draw, mister. Yeah, it's fine. Um, we'll just block it, and then we'll harsh rule. That's a lot of guys. Echo on those isn't bad. This ends now. And then we can uh, we can wait. We don't need harsh rule just yet. We don't need it back. So he apparently had some big stuff going on. So here's where we start. We start lighting it up with our boy here. Hopefully he doesn't silence him. That's fine. We'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe with that all day long. We can even silence it. Um, first, let's draw a card. It's written right here. Do we sacrifice it for two? Or do we draw two off the bat? I think this is more mana efficient. Well, we drew the bomb. <laughs> we drew the bomb, unfortunately. All right. So we end the turn. We want to be able to block this. If this starts getting free hits. Um, draw some cards first. Yeah, unfortunately, drawing cards means we... draw draw the uh, the bombs here we put that on the top we end turn he just straight up passes huh all right playing with fire here with these bombs though that's good play this play this in the turn. All right, this is how it's supposed to work. You just keep keep drawing cards. All right, we just end the turn again. Two of them. Ouch. That's a bit of a problem. So we're gonna Think you can we're gonna silence one of them. So it's down on the ground. All right. No bombs. No bombs. No bombs. That's brutal. Let's just, well, we don't really care. Let's end the turn. I wish we can get this through. Ouch, that really stings. Um. can block these. Mm. I think we let that through. Beautiful. So he lets that through. Harsh rule. This ends now. Granted, he's got those bombs in our deck, but I think we got a better chance at. Ooh. Draw, mister. That's a little bit scary. Okay. Just kill that. 
end the turn. Hey, there's our boy. Hopefully he doesn't have any answer for it. Beautiful. Make each bullet count. Do you got an answer for that one? Nope. So he's down to nine. We need two damage. We need four damage. Hmm. He's got to have the answer next turn, and we got him. Brace yourself. Deals double damage. Okay. <laughs> there it is. There it is. But, uh, yeah, that's the list, man. I, I really enjoyed it. It might be cheesy, but... I really like those five five flyer guys. They uh, they're pretty awesome. If uh, if you got the scraps to craft them, uh, definitely give them a go. But oh wow, four premium versions of that. That's pretty cool. But uh, that's the video for today, guys. Like always, thanks for watching. Uh, it, I hope you enjoy the eternal content as much as I do. Uh, Granted, like I've always said, Gwen is my game. This this is just something uh, that I like to play on my phone. And every once in a while, I like throwing a video out for it. I, I think it's a pretty cool game. But uh, like always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.